In this video, I'm gonna share with you what kind of salaries actuaries can expect to earn in 2019. We will go over how much actuaries earn today, the organizations that pay actuaries the most money, and the five highest paying metro areas for actuaries in the United States. Coming up. Hey everybody, my name is Stephen Hack, and this is Career Watch, where we cover job statistics, salary statistics, and other career information to help you make good decisions. If you end up enjoying this video, you can support us by subscribing. Actuaries analyze the financial costs of risk and uncertainty. They use mathematics, statistics, and financial theory to assess the risk of potential events, and they help businesses and clients develop policies that minimize the cost of that risk. Actuaries' work is essential to the insurance industry. Let's get into the salary statistics. In the year 1999, the average actuary was making $71,880 per year. By the year 2018, this average wage had risen to $116,250 on average nationally. So actuary salaries collectively rose a little over $44,000 over a period of 20 years. This comes out to an average gain of $2,218 per year. So we can estimate that the average actuary across the United States will make on average a little over $118,000 per year. The wage growth has been very consistent over the years. Wages haven't dropped once in the past 20 years. Next, let's take a look at actuary pay by organization. The finance and insurance industry pay actuaries the most money, followed by engineering and other services, and then the government. Only around 1% of actuaries are self-employed, and this data doesn't cover them. So that is the average national wage for actuaries. But depending on the metro area an actuary could live, their local pay could be much higher or lower. For example, an actuary in the Salt Lake City, Utah metro area makes almost $35,000 below the national average. For actuaries, it is important to know not only which metro areas pay the most money, it's also important to know which metro areas have the greatest number of job opportunities. There's only about 20,000 jobs for actuaries. This isn't like nursing where there's millions of jobs and you can live in any metro area across the United States. I have a separate video on actuary jobs. It is titled Actuary Jobs 2019. Next, let's take a look at the five metro areas that pay actuaries the most money. The fifth highest paying metro area for actuaries is the Albany, New York metro area. There's 220 jobs and the local metro pay is $13,120 over the national average. The fourth highest paying metro area for actuaries is the San Francisco metro area. There's 370 jobs, the cost of living is relatively high, and the local metro pay is $16,010 over the national average. The third highest paying metro area for actuaries is the Seattle, Washington metro area. There's 320 jobs, the cost of living is much cheaper than San Francisco, and the Seattle average wage is $16,200 over the national average. The second highest paying metro area for actuaries is the New York City metro area. There's 2,000 jobs, which is 10% of all actuary jobs. The cost of living is very high, but the New York average wage is $33,450 over the national average. And the highest paying metro area for actuaries is the Bridgeport, Connecticut metro area. There's 210 jobs, and the local Bridgeport average pay is $35,050 over the national average. So those are currently the five highest paying metro areas for actuaries. Are you interested in becoming an actuary? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, you can support us by subscribing and I will see you next time.